it's Cheryl here, brand strategist and graphic designer behind Made on Sunday Studio, an inspired and relaxing studio space for all things branding, design, and creative entrepreneurship. Now today, I wanted to show you how to create your own super stunning, super eye-catching Instagram stories that are animated. Uh, it's going to be no design experience needed and completely free on Canva. Um, it's a really great way Way to bring your Instagram to life by posting video style animated Instagram stories. So if you are interested in creating your own, let's dive into my computer and let me show you all the features to animate your Instagram stories on Canva. All right, so to begin creating your animated Instagram story graphic, we are gonna log into Canva and start with a template. I mean, um, Canva has a ton of great templates for every graphic need. Um, so I always recommend everyone to start with a, a template, but if not, you can also go here, create a design um, and just start with um, Instagram story here, which will give you the perfect dimensions and a blank slate, or you can actually just type it in here, Instagram story. And then it will show you all of the amazing templates that they have for free to use. Um, you can just look through them and see which one you might like. Um, all right, so this is the template that I am going to begin with. I really love the colors in here and I love that there's uh, some Instagram, uh, there's some graphics with images and some with more text. So it's a really good mixture of uh, both. So I really want to start my project with this template. All right, so to begin, editing this so that I can personalize this for my own Instagram. Um, one thing that you can do with creating animation is using video. So um, if you recorded something um, or you screenshotted something on your computer, then you can use that footage. For me, I recorded something, so I'm just gonna go to my uploads and find my videos. So let's say I like this video here. I can just drag my video into this placeholder and there we go. It plays my video. Perfect. That looks really good, but it's actually cutting out my, my text here. So I'm just going to double click this. Um, just one click here so I can uh, make sure the whole Sundays is showing. There, that looks better. I'm just going to center this. Okay, it's already centered. So now it, if I play this video, it's going to show the whole text here. Okay, I really like that. Um, so that's one way to animate your video. So if I were to just download this right now, this would be an animated, it would be a video. Um, so another great way to animate your Instagram stories is to use elements. Now, I don't know if you know this, um, there are a lot of static elements, uh, meaning that they don't animate on Canva, but they actually have a ton of animated graphics that can bring your Instagram stories to life, kind of like those GIFs that you, or the GIFs, I don't know, however you like to say it, GIFs, um, when you are uh, editing it into in, in Instagram stories, you can actually do that right on Canva as well. And there's a bigger collection of animated graphics. So um, if you just scroll down, um, you're actually going to see stickers. And if you see all, you're going to see like all the different categories that they have. They have just a ton of really fun stickers. Um, but I have a couple shortcuts it's really hard to find what I need here. You can always like um, r search for them. So I have a couple shortcuts and tips on how to search for my favorite animated elements. So I'm just gonna go into this document. I actually created a cheat sheet for you guys um, on all of my favorite animated graphics on Canva. So um, this is what you would have to uh, basically you would need to uh, search. So you can type in animated arrows and you're gonna find all of these fun things. Uh, animated sparkles, you're gonna find all of these. Uh, animated line and you're gonna find like different lines and um, 
different accents and animated words. So these are all my favorite search terms to kind of save you time when you are searching for some cool animated uh, graphics just to add onto your um, on your graphics. So let's just go with animated sparkle. So you're going to see all these fun sparkles that come up. Um, a few of my favorites are this one right here. So this is like huge. So I'm just going to drag the corner and make this smaller. And then instead of like dragging it from here, which sometimes I actually press on Pinterest sign, which is annoying. You can actually press on this right here to move it. I can actually put it right on top of my video, which is so cool. Um, there we go. That's really cute. Let's say I wanted to... Um, let's put um, an animated word in here. Maybe I came up with this graphic in October. <laughs> so I can just add this in. The only thing about these animated graphics is that they you can't change the color because they are in video format. So unfortunately, let's say I put it here, you can't really see it, but you can see it on top of the picture. So I'm just going to add that there. All right. Let's say for this one, I wanted to add animated line. Maybe I wanted to do a really cute, like, accent in the corner. Let's use this one right here. I think that's really cute. All right, so you can just um, reduce the size, and then I'm going to put it right in this corner. And I, and if you click on this, you can just uh, change the direction of that to make sure it's on the corner. So that's really cute. And then for the last one here, I really want to do an underline. I really love some of their underline options here. So for example, these ones right here, that's a really cute one. So I'm just going to make this smaller and then move this to right here. And I can just position it backwards just once so it's behind the text. So I think that's really cute. Um, I'm actually going to be sharing this template with you um, so that um, not only can you, you know, have, get a reminder of what to search for, um, but also you can simply, let's say you really love this one right here, you can just click on it and then just cop, command copy. So copy and paste it into your design. So let's say I want to put it right here. There we go. Super easy. Um, and then you can just uh, drag it into the position that you like it to be in. Um, so yeah, I thought this would be a really easy way for you guys to find all of my favorite animated graphics in Canva. Um, so just look into the description below for the link to the template um, and it'll open right into your Canva account and then you can just easily like drag and drop it into your graphics. Super easy. So the third way to animate your graphics is uh, this animate function. So if you click on, let's say this page right here, you're going to see this animate button uh, come up. So you just click on animate. And then you're going to see a ton of different options on how to animate this. You can play with it and see which one you like. Fade, pan. I really love this one if I'm doing like different, like a storyline. So each one of them will pan. So it looks like it's going to the next story. Rise, it goes upwards. Tumble. Simple is like nothing. <laughs> I think simple is just going to go to the next page um, and then these are the ones with the crowns on top those are pro features so just to give you a sneak peek if you want to get your pro crown you're going to get these options as well they're pretty cool i love using this scrapbook one look at that it's not cute all right so my audio got cut out here a little bit so i'm just going to talk over um, my video basically i'm just trying out all the different animate options um, you can play with it as you like, change it for every one of them, or you can click on apply all and they'll apply to all of them. 
basically you're going to go at the top right here and click on play and you can kind of see how the video might turn out on insta stories um, just to get a little preview of what it might look like you can kind of see the october it looks like it was just handwritten out and then we have the next slide just gonna go through it and see how it looks love the underlying effect all right and then um just gonna <laughs> open it and there we go now we're gonna go to the top right once you're done um you just click on download and if you uh click on kind of mp for video that which is going to be the default that is actually going to download all of these um, graphics together and on insta stories that's not what you're going to want to do you want to download them separately so you're just going to go into selecting the pages um, and then you just download it one by one so download page one and then page two page three etc and it will download them separately and that is all the different features that you can use on Canva to animate your Instagram stories. Super fun, super beautiful, and free. So if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and tap that notification bell so you know when the next video comes up. Um, I try to post every Sunday um, anything to do with branding, design, and creative entrepreneurship. So if that is something that you're interested in, uh, please follow me and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye! Southerly at about 15 with gusts of 25 miles an hour. Barometric pressure 30.00 and is rising.